cool, cool. Want me to go anywhere specific today? Uh, what are you trying? Anything? Did you do that right? Lying down the steep? Yep, or not? No. You're going to try that one? No. No, you're stay. Stay middle. Okay. I haven't tried middle actually. That's the thing though, the outside line's the same. Yeah, so but outside then you then, you then you turn and it's yeah. straight. Yeah. It's straight, rough, but it's straight. Mm -hmm. I think that line will get better because more people are gonna do it now too, so they'll clean it out and it like, might even have a little ledge. Uh, the right line. Yeah, I'm gonna try it. But you? Anything specific? Um I'm still not sure about that. Like up Remember? top, inside? Or? No, I'm gonna go outside there. Where you went wide at Worlds last year. Oh, down yeah. the bottom. I, I really don't know. <laughs> like, it's really close sometimes. I think the well, time we turn, is, yeah. yeah. So, like, whatever we, you... We, last night, we like, because I did both, yeah. not like super fast, but it was like exactly the same. On that, if it's that close, it's whatever you feel comfortable doing. Yeah. And I, I think the outside line, like if you're feeling strong at that point, you can pedal down to it and rail around it. It's not as tech. Okay. Did you fart? <laughs> That's pretty wet. You could actually just miss this bit. Bonjour. Hello, how are you? Bonjour. Good. Wild strawberries. Yeah. Frais? Frizz, yeah. Frizz. I'm learning. Petit peu. <laughs> oh, I got one. Oh, that's the smallest one. It's tiny. Petit. We are quite close to the top of the track. Just here, there's an inside line that it's on every year, but it's a little bit awkward, so it tightens up a lot at the end. And you do a lot of braking, but you hit the outside line, it's just a no brainer. You can not brake, just carry speed around it. But it's really close on time, so just trying to work it out. Then it, at that point, it becomes like whatever most comfortable for the rider. Cuckoo! Ball up! You know, like, you know what you're talking about, that corner? Yeah. Loris just did what I said Marcelo did yesterday. Tight. So like, well, just coming in. You know when you come in and you, you move across to the left and it's a bit rough and then you do the whole turn. Come in a little bit more to the right and you have a quick look. Uh, like stay on the right hand side of the trail on the flat bit just before it. On the way into it. Yeah. Look at the mother hall. I'm just missing the... You know what, I was just thinking that as I was picking <laughs> strawberries. I hope we don't miss Luca. We just missed him. <laughs> Fuck. Morning. You good? Still a, little, still a little bit slick today. Mm, definitely. 80 perfect conditions at the moment. Yeah. It's fun. Good. <laughs> That's when you go fast, when it's fun. Seen anyone hit this right line yet? I oh, know it's. Yeah. Did it look good, or? You see, he yeah. had it slow up there. It went pretty good here, like it didn't. Yeah. didn't see, it was shorter, but then he had it do quite a slow up over there. Well, this is one of the sections I looked at like early yesterday morning, but it was still really wet, and everyone was like having to come across and then get squared up so they could break down this steep bit. But I looked at this tight, like inside right line and now it's dried out, it's opened it up. <clears throat> There's quite a few people doing it. Denim destroyer pinning it. He said he wasn't gonna try it. I think he was steady just looking at it. He went over that, just in front of you, he went over that stump He didn't have to fight the exit as much. I think that was pretty quick. It's a lot shorter too. 
Boris and Luca are back in the pit. I'm on the steep section. If there's any questions. Yo, Steve, Luca. Yo, Luca. Uh, you're in the steep shoot. I'm in the steep shoot. Yeah, you went to the right. Look solid, mate. Look good. People are attacking the like middle line a little bit more, but like they can attack, but then they still have to anchor up and get a little bit squirrely for that next right hander before the drop. Sweet, yeah. I think I can go faster on that line too, so I'm gonna keep doing it. Bob on our kid. You reckon that the steep shoot, like on the right line, is okay? Yeah, I talked to Luca about it just now. You, it looked like you just tried it, didn't you? Greg was doing it yesterday, and he like he committed to it a little bit more, um, so made it like look look really good actually, because it's a lot shorter. I might try to go a bit faster on that right line and see what happens. Yeah, I think that's good because it's way shorter. That one's nice. That was nice. He's more, he's conf more confident on that line now because he's done it three or four times now. So there's a lot of stuff on this track hidden that you don't really see that makes you like slip all over and like one lap you go through it fine, next lap you slip a little bit. So it's a little bit unsettling. Oh, that's quite nice there, fuck. So we're getting a little bit slippy through this like middle before the plunge. So wasn't that called Petey's Plunge? No, there was Petey's Plank up there, wasn't there? That road gap. So Petey's Plunge was just Wyndham? Yeah. When you were on a, weren't you about to win that one? Yeah. Oh. You want to come up and look? There's a couple of lo tiny little things like... Yeah. You can't come in like hot in that line. Yeah. Like, uh, I thought I was coming fast there, wasn't it? You see this side, like that little line in between? Right, try, 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 try. Middle. Yeah. Like, no, no, middle. Yeah. There. Yeah. That's what I want to do, but I'm always too late. It looked like you were braking a bit on it. Yeah, you just have to let off the braking. Yeah. I think just aim for, like, just the bottom of that stump. Yeah. And then you're through. Greg! Solid for an old boy. He carried, he carried good speed onto that wood, didn't he? You good? After your rest? Yeah. Oh, sorry. I haven't seen in the back side. No problem. No. Okay. Do you think get on that jump to there, maybe? Yeah, middle patch. Yeah. And you have to be really like right, because yeah. when you're coming too low, you're gonna end up on the stump. Yeah, after. yeah. And then right, jump off the stumps into the turn and yeah. like get a kick out of that yeah. turn. Yeah, I like it. You got it, bruh. Yeah, I'll see in a bit. See in a bit. Oh man, still, still got it, huh? <laughs> you need bikes. <laughs> uh, Luca Shaw from Santa Cruz Syndicate team. Verliert eine halbe Sekunde bei der vierten Zwischenzeit. Gibt nochmal mächtig Gas. Zweiter wird er. Zweiter. 2,56. 53.52. Greg Minard, taking the lead. Things are a bit more difficult for the Frenchman. Auch gepasst wird die Ocean für Loris Vergier. 2.53.85. Platz 3, ganz knapp hier. I was just dead at the end. Like cooks. How was it, brother? Uh, well, that is good. It's definitely like I finally felt like I could run. Yeah. No, you look good. I, I was down at that minus wall. You look fucking solid there. But uh, I made like a couple of little mistakes at top, and uh, I'm pretty stoked because I wasn't too far off. So. I nearly texted you to say how fucking dry it was, but in the I got into the woods. I was like, it's so dry. Like, it was way dry. Not bad. I think you were both like a second off at the top. 
Like early. Oh, Off is like uh, back to racing. Oh, uh, he's son. back. Oh. There he is right now. Yeah. You were behind. Like Danny, Danny's top was really fast. I did like the inside of the grass. I feel slower after. Yeah. And I hate the first corner. He railed it. Like there's a second on the first corner. Maybe. It was just like. Wah, wah. It's got to look at some splits. Yeah.